Hello guys, <clears throat> today I'm going to be creating the first video in the Ktinker project series. However, in this video I will not be going over any code. Actually, because this project is being done in a special format, I'm not going to be, I'm not going to be getting into the Ktinker code until the very end of this project. But this project will cover more than just Ktinker. Um, as you can see in this flowchart, this project will be using an MVC model viewer controller style which is generally used for web apps but by web apps I mean like you know HTML uh, web applications something that you find on your browser but this project because it's using Ktinker it's not going to be a web app but a desktop app but I figured that why not just get get some experience with MVC using this anyways so yeah here's basically the blueprint of my project I'm calling it the Python Database SQL Lite 3 MVC project. This will have a public GitHub repository. I'm not going to be linking it on this video yet, but in the next video when I start with the code, I will have a link to the repository in the description box. And yeah, the gist of the project, it will consist of three, maybe four scripts, and a few other folders that have images, uh, sound files, and the etc. I will update this blueprint um, as we go on in the project because right now it's just very bare bones and basic but because I want to cover everything from Ktinker such as slide every aspect of Ktinker such as sliders, buttons, um, viewing images etc. I'm going to be adding un some unnecessary complexity to this project so that I have a reason to cover all those topics from Ktinker. Originally I wanted to do this with JSON, but as I was research ah, as I was researching JSON, I figured that just using a basic SQL3 Lite database would be a little bit better, and then I can just move on to a, J a JSON tutorial with SQLite 3 later on. Sorry, I'm getting all my words mixed up. Um, I'm doing this recording of kind of last minute, but yeah. So yeah, let me just go over the blueprint. We will have our mains.py script. This will be our model. Basically, this will this file will be the middleman between the view and the controller. The controller being our database where all our information is stored, and the view being our Ktinker script, which will take in input from the user, as well as display data that's saved in the database to the viewer. The model is basically the backend that controls both of them. And this will be the script that will be called up first whenever the application is run. It will not have any Ktinker code or SQLite 3 code inside it. It will simply manage the two files that work with those two um, packages. And this will be respon responsible for micromanaging everything in the application. So that will be our main.py. Now the Ktinker part is the graphical user interface. Basically when the app is run, you will see a GUI, just like a calculator for example. When you see the calculator being opened, this is all the graphics. This is all the visual stuff. None of the backend is visible to us right now. So the Ktinker part will basically be the graphics, the front end. It will take in data and then for example, 8 times 8, I run it, it gives out 64. However, all this data is being saved in a controller somewhere, and the model is the backend software doing the calculations. So that's an example of how MVC works in a calculator. So yeah, in this case, our front end will be handled by Ktinker. And finally, we have our controller, which is the SQLite 3 database. It'll be a script that works solely with SQLite 3. The database will be a separate script, but it will be created and managed from the script that manages it. And as you can see with the arrows, all the data that goes in and out from both of all three of them is managed by the model. So this is going to be our format for the project. And yeah, I haven't started yet, which is why I'm not linking the GitHub repository yet, but Coming this this upcoming weekend after my $700 PC gaming PC build video, 
I will come up with the first video for this and yeah that should be it so yeah I hope you guys have a good one and I will see you guys later peace out